YouTube, and this is Maximo Fox, and today I am doing my very first video, or technically official video, well, official gameplay video on YouTube, and I am playing City Skylines, uh, this game that, that I got recently, I mean, it's been out for a couple years, I think, but it's basically this extremely fun game where you just build a city. And, yeah, I have downloaded a bunch of mods, which will help me in the building of, uh, of the city, such as like a, this mod up here is, can help you control intersections and, and just help you control where the cars go better on the roads. This one down here helps, can allow you to move everything individually so you don't have to, like, continually, you don't have to always just replace what you just put down with that, yeah, so you don't have to bulldoze it and then re replace it and then just keep doing that until you get it correct, which that can be very technical. Now, I, I have unlimited money turned turn on, so my goal for the city is not, is not to really try to beat the game. Really, there's you really can't beat the game. It's, it's just a continuous game. Really, I mean, if you could count beating the game, getting everything down here, like these monuments and uh, you know, and some other stuff. But yeah, I'm I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna build and you guys just enjoy. You guys just enjoy this. Um, now, the map that I chose is called Aurora Borealis. I'll probably put the link to it down in the description. And it's really just... Here, if I... It's... It's... Uh, well, as you can see, it's kind of... It, it is on the ocean. But there are mountains going, surrounding the... Surrounding a little over half the map, and then you have, and then you have like a couple rivers and uh, yeah, there's a small lake right there, and some islands, and some flat flat places, forests or plains, I should say, and forests. Yeah. Now, like most maps, it does already come with, with roads on it highways such as like interstates and yeah and and expressways and uh, and yeah but now I have gone ahead and bought all 25 tiles because I mean well normally you get only nine but I found this mod where you can get all 25 so we have most of this entire area to work with Everything in that blue is what, is what we can work with. Now, I'm probably not going to build too far in this corner, or just really like over here maybe. I mean, obviously on this island, but or over here, like on the, on the side of the, this mountain, on the side of this mountain, because, I mean, it it would look very good to, to just have my, my city just keep going all the way out to here and then just end because it reached the edge of the playable area. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, so obviously you're gonna wanna try to centralize your area or whatever, centralize your city, whatever you want to, uh, so you don't run into the, to the edges of the map. Now, the start, it, it starts you off right here at this interchange. Now, okay, so before we start the city, I am, I'm gonna just edit this interchange a little bit so that uh, it just looks a little bit better, maybe. Because I mean, I I like to find I like my roads to be detailed and just look nice. So uh, I'm gonna go do that, and uh, so 
but I'm gonna go, uh, or I'm, I'm gonna be doing this first before I start on the actual city part. Okay, there you go. So this is this is a little bit better. I mean, if you if you were to take a comparison of interchange beforehand, it wouldn't be much difference. But uh, if you didn't catch in that uh, in the video of me building it, then that I just showed. Uh, well, I upgraded this road right here. And that turns and, and goes out on, that crosses both rivers. I changed that into a four lane road after the interchange and before it. So then, so then it would make more sense for when I split off, split the two probably highways off or freeways off, this one could be three lanes because for right now this has a lot of traffic on it. And then for these to be only two lanes, like, and then they go in more into the city. 
Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to make this into an actual another freeway or if I'm just going to stick with the freeway that we already have. But, I mean, that'll get decided later. And also, since this is, since the city's going to be a complete, this, I mean, this interchange might change, I don't know, maybe a couple times while I'm building the city. While I'm building the city, so yeah, it, this is probably not permanent, but this is a little bit better than than what it was originally. Because I mean, I made it slightly more compact. This, this is probably going to be where uh, the main city is going to be. Oh, and I just realized I haven't talked about what I really want my city to look like. Now I I, I love just like a whole ton of skyscrapers and like the downtown and such but I think for my first city I might just do like a small to medium sized city that is probably going to be so that is mostly going to be similar to uh, maybe like a midwest city a midwestern city in the United States so like uh, might, look a, might, might look a little bit like Denver or um, maybe the outskirts of Chicago because I mean Chicago is pretty is a very big city anyway so and as traffic gets more intense I might also upgrade these to two lanes but for now these are these will do fine and if. If you didn't catch in the video, what I did was I had only certain lanes from the four lane only go on to the to certain lanes of the three and the two, and the same and the same vice versa for the three and the two to go into the four. And also up here because if this was if this was realistic, I if this was in real life, I would design this road to be four lanes, and then up here since this is a major interchange. I would make this outer lane, which is kind of what I had, which is kind of what I did, be this, be this off ramp, and then these three lanes just to keep going forward. Now I'm not sure how that will, that will, will work out if I change this to two lanes, but also if any of you more experienced uh, city skylines players out there are watching this video um, how and if you have mods how exactly would I how exactly do I f smooth this out with the move it mod like th this little bump right here I, I don't know like as far as I can tell I, I can't do much about it but I literally just got these all these mods like yesterday as of the day of recording this video but yeah so Anyways, to wrap this video up, I am, I'll probably start a little bit on the city, um, and maybe, and maybe move, move some of the highway around, but, um, the next video is probably gonna start working on, oh yeah, actually, I, I didn't tell you exactly where I, I wanted to go. so, according to this map, I want, so, I'm probably going to have, like, this area be more industrial, be more d industrialized. It's, it's right ne next to the river, and it has, and by the river, it has mountains across it and next to it. And then there's also some more mountains over here. And then over here is probably going to be more of the downtown area. But, as I said, there's probably not going to be too many skyscrapers. I mean, obviously there, there might be a couple, but yeah, like like this, this would be the, like, the downtown waterfront area, and then over here would might be like some more. I don't know. I, I might do some terraforming here, connect these three islands, to make one big island, and then over here probably some more, probably a little bit more of the downtown, maybe like right here, and then I'll get more into maybe some prison. Residential, and then this island right here, I think I'm gonna have it be residential, and then like this is gonna be more of a shopping center or something. Or, and I and 
Actually, I might just do like have a more of a separate town right here between this mountain and, and, and this river, and then maybe a little bit more residential on, on this island here. And then if I were to connect these, it would be probably even more residential. But yeah, so I'll probably divide up the city into like five or six different districts, not including out outs. Uh, town from the outskirts, like I might put a town here, uh, maybe here, and possibly like right here outside the, right outside the ind industrial area. Oh, this is cool. So, quarry area. Okay. Yeah. Now I also want to find some more bridge bridge models, but I, I can do that another day. Okay, well, uh, this has been my very first City Skylines video, and uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, if, uh, hopefully, you stick around, then I see, and you, uh, and you guys see the next video. So, uh, bye!